Prabhupada spoke so much about book distribution. He said that these temples are not a place for eating and sleeping, but a base from which we send out our soldiers to fight with Maya. And to fight with Maya means to drop hundreds of thousands of books into the laps of the conditioned souls, just like in wartime, the bombs are raining from the sky. Prabhupada said, so this is our mission, this is our purpose. As it's described that the associates of Lord Chaitanya were his soldiers, and that is Srivast, Nichananda, Advaita Chaya is like generals, and you know, Prabhupada is often referred to as a Sankatan general. And often the books are compared to bombs, time bombs, that uh, can go off at any second. I never met a devotee, I, I got the book in a cafe, someone in fact left it on the table, and then I got it and phew, it went off. Prabhupada always says that book distribution is our main activity. And, uh, and he said that uh, his books will be the law books of mankind for the next 10,000 years. So you can see how important book distribution is. And if you give somebody a book, it stays with them. Papa said that books are as good as deities. So when they enter into somebody's house, it's the same as having Krishna there in their home. And just by seeing that book, Bhagavatam explains that this is the literary incarnation of God. It's non different than Krishna. So the four full-time book distributors are uh, Tarun Krishna Prabhu, who is the Sankirtan leader, uh, Subal Prabhu, who's been doing book distribution now for coming up to seven years, uh, solid, um, Bhakti Sean from Ireland, and Bhakti Joan Mark. And then we have Mother Sharada, who's doing book distribution at lunchtime every day, usually. And then we have the congregation who come out once a month on Maha Saturday Sankirtan, the last Saturday of each month. 9.45 book points. Bhakti Shon, Prabhu, collected 55 Lakshmi points, distributing 30 small books, 7 big books for 11.5 book points. My activities in the temple were sleeping, honouring Prasadam, um, chanting Hare Krishna, Kirtan, a little bit of Pajari service, uh, playing Madanga, um, reading, studying, and also... Uh, um, Five, six days a week I go out and distribute um, BBT publications, mostly written by Srila Prabhupada on Oxford Street and surrounding areas. I tell people they're the ultimate home entertainment system. Uh, people spend thousands of pounds on DVDs and MP3s, TVs, big you know, screens and Playstations. What's a new one? PSP, Game Boy, a dual screen, and they spend so much money on CDs. But all you need is a set of Srila Prabhupada's books. All you need is Bhagavad Gita, Srimad Bhagavatam, Chaitanya Charitamrita. And that's a, for the big sets, just a few hundred pounds. It'll keep you going for the rest of your life. So yeah, it's a very blissful activity. And to not do it is very difficult. Once you've got that taste, and then you have to go and do something else. Like for myself, I have to do some management or stay back some days. It's very difficult to not go out. It's so blissful. So I recommend everybody to get that taste. Well, if you go on Oxford Street, there's, not, there's no old people hardly. Uh, all the people are kind of good-looking, trendies, and they think they're happy. They've got their youth, their health, they've got money, um, or they've got a credit card at least. Um, and so it's, you, know, you need to be convinced that these people need Krishna. And I'd like to do travelling Sankatan to get a motor home and to um, go out with the devotees in that facility, because although this is a wonderful temple, there's many different things that are going on. So for travelling Sankatan, then it's just three or four of you living in a van, and that's all you do. The claim Ridanga that we have, we can just sound it, and it will just sound in the room here. But book distribution is a Brihat Mridanga. It is being sounded all over the world and purifying the lives of many, like thousands of people every day. But there's a special reciprocation there from Krishna because the preaching is so solid. Yeah, there's nothing so ecstatic as giving somebody a book.